Uh, I'm Bill Leahy. I'm the director of the New York State Office of Legal Services, and I want to uh, welcome all of you to the Public Defender Career Fair, the third annual uh, in New York. And to cut to the chase, I think, on what I really want to say to you today and, and welcoming you is as hard a time as this has been for you all to be law school students uh, and participants in programs and so on during this, these virtual days, uh, it is a fantastic time to be coming out of law school and, and seeking uh, a career as a public defender in the state of New York. And I mean anywhere in the state of New York. Uh, I remember so well my own law school days back in the uh, 70s, um, the thrill of going into prisons, meeting clients, representing uh, people in court, learning how to defend people, meeting public defenders, meeting private lawyers, dealing with judges. Um, some of you have had that and some of you, your activities have been curtailed, I'm sure, by the pandemic. Uh, but right now we're in the midst of a revolution in public defense in the state of New York. The state of New York has promised uh, an annual additional funding of $250 million a year. They have already appropriated in year three of the five-year plan, 150 million. They're moving it up at 50 million per year. New jobs are being created in the city, in the suburbs, in the rural counties, all over the state of New York. Um, we're also in an era of attention to all sorts of inequality economic inequality, gender inequality, racial inequality. Uh, and we need people badly to join the struggle to affirm the humanity of every single person who is charged with a crime in the state of New York. Uh, it's an honorable career. It's a noble career. Uh, most of my career before I came to New York nine or 10 years ago was in Massachusetts. And on one memorable occasion, the Chief Justice of the top court in Massachusetts was heard to say that all public defenders are saviors. I don't know about saviors, but all public defenders are advocates for justice. All public defenders affirm the humanity of their clients. All public defenders make sure that everyone in the process knows that they are there to defend their client, each and every client. They are there to balance the scales of justice. They are there to make it clear to everyone in the process that a client is not defined by what he or she may have done, assuming the government can prove what they are alleged to have done on, on the night or the day in question. So it's a fantastic profession. It's a perfect time. Uh, you have choice upon choice upon choice throughout New York 62 counties, throughout New York's 140 or 50 providers of public defense representation. You have a state fully invested both um, financially and programmatically in making sure that the public defense reforms that were triggered first by the Harrell Haring lawsuit and then by the state law that extended counsel at arraignment and quality improvement um, protections and starkly reduced caseloads all across the state. Um, it's been such a pleasure for us to play a significant role, I think, in, in making sure those reforms live up to their promise. We need and we have funding for to support uh, many new hundreds of public defenders. Uh, so uh, it is a great time. I know you've got opportunities to interview both today and in the future with a lot of great providers all across the state. Uh, it's a thrilling time to be entering public defense in New York. This pandemic will end the fight for human justice, racial justice, equal justice, and the humanity of every single client who ha is facing uh, the awesome power of the state in a prosecution entitled People Versus Your Client. It's a perfect time for you to be considering a public defense career. We need good oral advocates. 
We need good writers. We need people who will become the leaders of public defense programs uh, in the days and decades ahead. Um, I've been privileged uh, to have 46 years of very, very fulfilling professional involvement. Uh, I hope some of you out there uh, will have uh, a similar uh, a wonderful career-long experience in the exciting and honorable world of public defense. Thanks a lot and have a great day today. Good afternoon and welcome to the third annual New York State Public Defenders Career Fair. My name is Lorette Mulry and I have the great privilege of welcoming you as the president of the Chief Defenders Association of New York, a co-presenter of this event along with the University of Buffalo School of Law, New York State Defenders Association of New York, and the New York State Office of Indigent Legal Services. While this is our third such event, and of course, we miss being in the beautiful city of Buffalo like we've been the last couple of years. Um, we are doing this for the first time virtually. And I want to commend all of you for your initiative and resiliency in joining us here today. We have a record turnout. And I know that the organizations that are here to interview you are so excited to meet you and to get to know you. But first, I'd like to tell you about the Chief Defenders Association of New York, um, also known as CDANI. CDANI is an association of chiefs of defender organizations across the state who have direct oversight to attorneys who provide representation to indigent clients in criminal courts, family courts, as well as appellate courts. Our members include chiefs of institutional defenders like public defenders, conflict defenders and independent legal aid societies like the office that I oversee, which is the Legal Aid Society of Suffolk County, as well as assigned council defender programs. We have members from all regions of the state who cover many diverse programs, diverse by type of courts covered as well as type of programs covered. Many of these chiefs are here today and the career fair is a wonderful opportunity for them to get to know you, but also for you to get to know them and to learn about the organizations that they represent. Ask lots of questions. I know them and they're quite passionate about the work that they do and they do love to talk about it. Um, I'd also like to tell you a little bit about uh, the importance of public defense work, especially in a world of challenges like we find ourselves in today. A public defender is a fighter, one who takes pride in defending the rights of the poor. They work on the front lines and in the trenches. They see systemic injustice all around them and they work to do something about it. They have a commitment to their clients and to the presumption of innocence. They have the courage to stand up to a system that is often against them, to be a true courtroom advocate, one who can recognize and point out overreaching and charging and inequities in treatment. They have the fortitude to see past horrific accusations of the state and yet still find the humanity within, to realize that our clients enter the criminal justice system with many other issues such as mental illness, substance abuse, childhood trauma, and family conflict. For to be a true public defender, you must be uniquely able to take on these challenges and to believe in and be ready to navigate due process of law, all the while being able to explain it to your client at probably the most traumatic time in their life. Yes, these are great challenges, but there are also great rewards, and this is definitely the time to become a defender, as I believe that we are on the great precipice of change in the criminal justice system, one that will take into account the racial inequities of the past, and with our help, will work to reform to and reinvent the criminal justice system. So thank you for being here. We are excited to meet you and to learn all about you, and we hope that you will join the venerable profession that is a public defender. Thank you. Hello and welcome to the third annual New York State Public Defenders Career Fair. I am Susan Bryant, the Executive Director of the New York State Defenders Association, one of the sponsors of today's event. We're very excited to have so many of you participating this afternoon. Now is a great time to become a public defender in New York. New York State Defenders Association is a nonprofit membership organization that was founded more than 50 years ago with the mission of improving the quality and scope of public defense representation throughout New York. We have members all over New York State, including public defenders, legal aid society attorneys, assigned counsel lawyers, defense investigators, and others who support our mission and dedication to client-centered representation. 
NISTA runs the state's Public Defense Backup Center, which provides research support, training, publications, and other resources to public defenders, as well as members of the public defender team, including investigators, social workers, and mitigation specialists. We also run the Veterans Defense Program, which helps defenders represent their clients who are active duty military or veterans who are facing charges in criminal court or in family court. I encourage you to stop by our Zoom site during the career fair to speak to some of our attorneys about their experience as public defenders in family defense and in criminal defense and learn more about our organization. I wish all of you luck in your job and internship searches today and in the future. Please feel free to reach out to me if you have any questions or would like to become a member of the New York State Defenders Association. Our website is nysda.org. Thank you and have a great afternoon.